And now to our NewsHour Share, something that caught our eye. The video of a rescued chimpanzee's flight to wildlife sanctuary recently spread like wildfire on the Internet. The NewsHour's Julia Griffin tracked down the video's pilot and asked about his mission to save Africa's imperiled primates. <laughs> It's a simple video that tugs at the heartstrings. A baby chimp bonds with, sleeps on, and even learns from the man flying him to a safer home. The pilot is Anthony Carre, a Belgian aviator working for Virunga National Park in the Democratic Republic of Congo. Since I was a little boy, I had two big wishes, and I was flying small planes and animals. And when I had the opportunity to work for Virunga National Park, I grabbed it with uh, two hands. On a normal day, Kare is an eye in the sky, assisting rangers in anti-poaching patrols, wildlife censuses, and other duties. But a few times a year, he ferries orphaned apes and monkeys 400 miles north to Lero Primate Rehabilitation Center. His passenger this time was Musa, a three-year-old chimpanzee recently rescued from poachers. It's actually a very sad story because they took that little chimp away from his family. They killed his family. Poachers often sell slaughtered adult monkeys as bushmeat in local markets, but they prefer to peddle the baby animals as pets. Once confiscated from their captors, Lero provides primates like Musa a safe space to recover. The organization cares for more than six dozen chimps and nearly a hundred monkeys, many of which arrive malnourished, stressed, and physically wounded from tight ropes and small cages. Which is why, Kare says, most baby primates are not restrained during his flights. If you have like a, a really chill little baby chimp who is happy to be on your lap and it, it holds you, then you have the wrong effect when you put it in a cage. Then it will totally freak out, start to cry, and it can die actually. So we take the time to gain his trust, to feed him, and when he feels comfortable and he jumps on in your arms and he holds you, then it's the time to do the flight. And while he is happy his video went viral, Kare emphasizes this flight should never have happened in the first place. I hope the people not only say, OK, it's a cute movie, but the message is that that little chimp should be with his mom and not on my lap. Musa is now in quarantine with other rescued baby chimps. When he is ready, he will be introduced to a new chimp family. For the PBS NewsHour, I'm Julia Griffin. And it restores your faith in people.